remain in my love. If you keep my commandments, you will remain in my love, just as I have kept my Father's commandments and remain in His love. I have told you this, that my joy may be
pastor follow this text. We too we have calls for joy. Now before I get into uh, serving, we have a couple of extra scriptures. So we're going to start we're going to look at Romans chapter 8, verse 38. So 8, 38. Just mark your scripture for there and then we will come to that scripture in just a moment. And then also mark the scripture for the chapter, the love chapter. You know the love chapter in the Bible, right? First Corinthians 13, the whole chapter. Talks about love. We'll be the whole chapter with this excerpt from that chapter. The church say, Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. So how fitting it is that as we gather and that most auspicious occasion we had yesterday in honor of our mothers, that we all just have it in May. May we honor our mothers. May we remember the mother of our Savior, Mary. But before I get into talking about love, this is a very important scripture we had this morning. It's actually the apostles. That you are acceptable to Christ. Somebody say amen. amen. You are acceptable to Christ. So I'm going to turn to your neighbor and tell your neighbor.
sent to your email as a convenience. We will continue to produce bulletins in-house, but only a limited number will be printed. Please ensure your email address are up to date. If you have not received a flock note from St. Augustine, please contact the church office. This will also ensure that you receive up-to-date information regarding the parish, including the bulletin, directly in your email. Again, if you have not received a flock note from St. Augustine Catholic Church, please contact the church office. Regarding contact information, if St. Augustine members, if you have recently or in the past couple of years changed your phone number, your address, please notify the church office. This will also ensure that you receive important information regarding the parish and our activities. Immediately after the 11 o'clock mass on this Sunday, we will have the pleasure of Kayla and Marquisa, two of the solos for the La Boheme Opera, to come and sing two arias for us. Please come back and enjoy the richness and sounds of two wonderful artists. Thank you, Lord.